ASI's new Moments and Specialty Seating provides advanced and personalized support, specifically designed for the demanding work of today's dental specialists. Modern, advanced procedures coupled with the focus on reducing physical stress for both the doctor and the dental assistant has been culminated in the design of Momentum Specialty Seating. During this quick video, you will learn about Momentum's 8-point series of features and adjustments to personalize your support, balance, and movement capability. First, set the chair to a neutral position. This will make it easier to modify adjustments. Lift the backmost lever on the right side of your chair to allow you to push the back support of the chair all the way back. Next, set the seat to a starting horizontal position. Lift the lever on the left side of the chair and tilt the seat cushion all the way backwards. If you like, you can also pre-adjust the height of the arms to approximately where you would like them by loosening the knob located on each arm. Now you are ready to get started. For comfort, stability, and proper physical alignment, knee placement in accordance to the chair is important. Sit fully back into the seat and place a distance of three fingers between the back of your knee and the front of the seat. Second, set the proper height for the seat. On the right side of the chair, lift the foremost lever to raise or lower the seat height. Adjust until your feet touching the floor with your heels slightly raised off the floor. Third, we'll be adjusting your seat tilt. The ideal position for the hips is an open 110 degree angle from shoulders to hips to knees, allowing space for circulation throughout the lower back. Lift the lever on the left side of the chair to adjust the seat tilt down until your heels are firmly on the floor. ASI's Momentum Seating features Valencia upholstery paired with permablock to provide a non-slip yet smooth surface. ASI's Momentum 4 feature provides an important adjustable front slope of the seat. The button on the left side of the chair, when depressed, can adjust the front slope of the chair beneath your thighs. Press the button and hold in while pressing down the front of the seat to create a slight bend. Release the button to lock, pressing the button again while applying light pressure to allow the piston to lift up and lightly support the backs of the thighs without cutting off circulation. Fifth is to adjust the backrest so you are properly supported to prevent fatiguing of the back muscles without restraining your movement. The Momentum Specialty Seating is made with a convex shaped backrest to apply support to the curvature of the spine with specialized rubber grommets that allow the backrest to move with you as needed. Lift the backmost lever on the right side of the chair to adjust back support in to fully support your back while allowing you to sit straight up in a working posture. Like an athlete preparing for an event, the concave backrest can be used for stretching exercises throughout the day to provide periodic rest for the back muscles. Sixth, adjust the height of the lumbar support to properly fit the curvature of the small of your back. Adjust by lifting the backrest upwards until it fits your preference. If you adjust too high, simply lift the backrest all the way up, which will allow it to drop down to the lowest position. From there, lift again to find the right position. Seventh, adjust the height of the elbow rest to a height that supports the weight of your arms while relaxing the shoulders and neck. Adjust the height by loosening the knobs on either side of the chair and raise or lower as needed and retighten. Eighth, is to select the type of armrest that fits your working style best. Our specialty made armrests come in two available styles depending on if you prefer elbow or forearm support. The padded arm support features generous cushioning for elbow support. The padded armrest can be articulated left or right using the levers on the underside. Simply push or pull the lever in the direction you wish to ratchet the arm, adjust, and release. The cradle forearm style supports the forearms while allowing rotating and telescopic movement. Putting it all together, our eight-point checklist for optimal support and comfort breaks down to one, generous and angled seat design allows for proper seating and stable support with correct distance between back of knee to the front of the seat distance. Two, proper height off the ground with smooth yet slip resistant upholstery. Three, opening the hips to 110 degrees with seat tilt to reduce pressure on the spine. Four, proper back alignment for spinal support. Five, finding your ideal placement for the lumbar support cushion. Six, unique slope seat for optimal circulation to lower extremities. Seven, 
adjusting arm support to your stretcher and comfort to provide relief to shoulders and the neck. 8. Picking the ideal arm support that best fits your working style.